Hello and thanks for your interest in Thunder, the Drupal 8 distribution for professional publishing. In this screencast, I will show you how to add quizzes, polls and other types of interactive content to your article with the help of our partner Riddle. You can learn how to add Riddle to your Thunder installation with another tutorial. Find the link below. To import your Riddles, go to Content, click on the tab Media and then on Import my Riddles. Depending on how many Riddles you've created since you last did this, this may take some time, but usually it's really quick. To create a new Riddle, click on the tab Riddle. Here you can see the existing Riddles. By clicking on Create, you can see the different kinds of interactive content you can create. Quiz, Opinion Poll, Personality Test, List, Interactive Story, Survey, Ranked List and Reaction Poll. We will start with this, because it's the easiest type of riddle. At the top you can see the steps needed to create a riddle. At the right you can see a preview. We start and write a question here. What do you think of Thunder, for example? Then we add a picture here by dragging and dropping it in this area. Below I can decide on the response options. I go for like, dislike, but I could also add something unique. At the top you can check how the riddle will look like in different formats. White, square and tall. If you are happy with the results, click on Customize to design your riddle. You can decide on the colors and the font of your riddle. This is all part of the freemium functionality. If you decide to invest in an enterprise account, you can for example replace the riddle logo with your own brand and also create different templates with your own fonts and style sheets. Now click on Integration. In a premium account you can use these options to personalize your website. Click on Activate custom result landing pages to add a website your users will see after finishing the quiz. Add the website here and decide if it should be displayed in the riddle frame or outside, which I choose. Now we go to Publish. Click on Publish here to create your riddle. Now you get an URL, so you could add your riddle anywhere. Adding it to your Thunder article is even easier. For this, we go to Content and open this existing article by clicking on Edit. Scroll down to the paragraphs and add a paragraph for riddle. Then click on Select Riddle. The media browser opens and you can choose from already uploaded riddles. So first we have to add our new riddle to this collection by clicking on Import my riddles. Besides the tab media, this is a second way to import new riddles into Thunder. You see the uploaded riddle here. Click on it and then click on Select Riddle and it will be added to your article. Now save your changes and close the article. When I now open this article, you can see the riddle here at the top. You can use riddles to learn interesting things from your readers. I will show you how this works with an older riddle. So I go back to Content and Riddle. Here you can see the already created riddles. Click on the three dots next to it and choose Stats. Here you find the analytics about your riddle, how many people have seen it, how many have started it and how many have finished it. Below you find the results, not only for the whole personality test, but also for every single question. With this you can learn interesting facts about your users. You can download the data here as a table or with a premium account as PDF report. That's it for this time. Thanks for watching and have a nice time working with Thunder and Riddle. See you soon. 
Join the Thunder Coalition now. Spread the word, contribute, and benefit.